Well, hello. So today, we're going to talk about Unity. I'm going to throw in some Transformers in there, and we're going to talk about uh, dirtiness. Dirtiness? What is dirtiness? So first, we're going to talk about Unity. So Unity, we are all one. We are all cells of a body. If we have, if, when you see an ant running around and you're about to smash it because, you know, it's summer. And, sorry, ant, I know. <laughs> You'll come back as something else. The ant knows it, and so it tries to run away, right? Just as if one giant was trying to smash us, we would be like, ah! You know, maybe we would try to find an underground area, or maybe we would, you know, run zigzag. Maybe we would do a better job than the ant, <laughs> because our brain might be bigger. In the context of what, though? Um, so, uh, <laughs> maybe the ant's acceptance of death at that particular moment in time is much more than our <laughs> zigzagging ability to try to <laughs> make sense of this giant. Ah! <laughs> so, in regards to, you know, but I think about the Earth. I think about the Earth and how the Earth is kind of like a giant. So in Transformers, see that I was trying to Transformers, there's various different Transformers live in Cybertron. And if, and spoiler alert, spoiler alert, Cybertron actually transforms into a giant robot. So, I forget what the name of the robot is, but Cybertron does transform. And the cities within Cybertron transform into robots as well. So, and then the Transformers combine together. So, there's a sen definitely a sense of unity in the Transformers franchise from a physiological sense, like of literally combining and, you know, forming. Um, so, <laughs> um, I can make jokes about that. But I will not. I will keep it clean. Oh, but dirtiness. <laughs> See, this is a good way to tie it to dirtiness. So the thing is, is that there's people out there that will not accept gifts from you. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm not going to say it. Um, but there's people out there, even though we've had a giant conversation about what it is that I'm giving to you. But... <laughs> <laughs> Are you one of the characters from Memento? <laughs> Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so that's, you know, the sense of dirtiness, of people thinking other people are dirty, so therefore they are not willing to have interactions with those people. Um, various different faiths have this belief system. Uh, for gays, for instance, gays for most notably have been given this entire blanket of dirtiness. That if a man is sleeping with another man, women as well, of course, but men more so just because of the social psychological stigma of that men are not supposed to that procreate and make more. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Or machismo or whatnot. So, and you can't be a feminine male. Like, so you can't receive, I guess. I don't know. You're supposed to be the, the giver, not the receiver. <laughs> there's something, there's something denigrating towards someone being a receiver. So in, in psychological, mental, physical, in various different forms. So the dirtiness that comes with that, the dirtiness that comes with people that um, are not married and they're having sex, you know? Yeah, the dirtiness that people, there's certain people that will be like, I'm, I don't have those kind of friends. There's certain people that say that black people are dirty, that Asians are dirty because they don't fall under the same category as their category. Uh, there's some people that say white people are dirty because they don't fall under the same category as their category. So that if we are all unified and if we are all one and if we are all in some way, shape or form seeing each other, there's some people that see homeless people as dirty because, you know, they're dirty. <laughs> <laughs> but are they really, you know? It's like, um, so the various different elements that tie into who we are as society and how we all come together. Because um, we all have gifts. We all have gifts. And I think that that dirtiness that we play some over each other is, and we're all dirty in some way, shape, or form or another. If, if we weren't, we wouldn't be here. <laughs> That's my thinking. Because, you know, there's a, there, there's a flip side to the perfection of who we are. We are perfect, but yet we are not. It's weird. But, um, so yeah, so that's what I think. I wish you a wonderful year. It's going to be 4-4.